Hey guys, welcome back to another video in the series of Bash scripting or shell programming. Now this is the first video and as we promised in our last video that we are going to put the roadmap in the first video. So let's get started. So if we talk about the roadmap, so the first point is we'll discuss what is the need of shell scripting. We'll talk about the origin of it. We'll talk about how to use it and what's the need in the current scenario. Then we'll move on to what is shell, what is bash and how they came into picture and what do we have to do about it. Then we'll discuss about the things that are used in the script such as variables and comments and how to declare them, how to use them, how to, how to assign a value, how to do operations on them. The next we'll do what is the read user input, how to get an input through a user, how to edit it, how to get it in a value, how to manipulate it and other things. Then we'll teach how to pass arguments to a bash script. There are two ways to do it. There are passing it in a bash script and passing to the other bash script how to do that so there are the multiple way to there are multiple ways to do it we'll talk about each and everything and we talk about the if statement there are multiple options for that if elif else if and there are many languages that have these kinds of statements we'll talk about that we'll write up few programs few scripts and we'll test how to do the condition matching so we'll uh, study all this in if statement then the file test operators uh, how to do operations on some kind of files and how to create delete and stuff and we'll talk in very much detail for them then how to append outputs to the end of the file that that's very interesting topic we are going to talk once in our uh, with a separate dedicated video and then our logical and and or operators how to use them in a program how to make decisions we'll we'll discuss about that as well then we'll talk about the arithmetic operations then after that we'll talk about the case statement uh, how to take cases how to match the cases and how to get the results out of it after that we'll talk about the looping system and in the first way we'll talk about the while loop how to do it how to write a condition around it and how to rotate stuff around it then we'll talk about the until loop and how to use it it could be new to you and then we'll we'll just talk about that we'll talk about the live part live demo part for it and the very famous for loop that almost everyone uses for loop and um, depending on the condition you guys can switch between while until or a for loop how to use it how to start it what is the condition and up to what it will run we'll talk about that then we'll talk about the select loop in the similar manner then we'll talk about the break and continue how to break a program and it's running the condition getting fulfilled how to continue how to discontinue it how to get out of the program we'll talk about that in break and continue with examples then we'll talk about the functions functions as you already know that are backbone of of any kind of a program or a script because you have to do a lot of things in a function and it's we'll, we'll talk about how to declare a function how to make a call to a function and that and at the end we'll talk about miscellaneous things such as interview questions and program hands-on we'll write a lot of scripts in this uh, in this course and i'll upload each and everything on my github account i'll write in the description box you can get get it from there or you can write your own code and you can put in your own repository and just just make sure that you do hands-on because uh, things are going to be asked in an interview and I don't want you to be new to, new to all of this stuff. So uh, whatever topics we have discussed in today's roadmap is going to have a separate dedicated video and all of them will be uh, taken in consideration with examples so, so that you cannot forget what is happening over there and once we discuss the theory we'll do the practical part so it will be easier for you to understand. So I hope uh, these are the points we are going to talk about and there is, would be no particular order. We'll pick something, we'll go in line by line so that you guys can understand one by one and do not get confused. So if I have missed anything, feel free to comment below and we can address that. So thanks guys and if there is anything, feel free to comment below and we'll uh, take care of that. So I'll see you in the next video.